How are we going? Okay, so I'm about to uh, try to transfer uh, or split half half of this colony of Trigona carbonaria uh, native Australian stingless bees into uh, the other box there. I've never worked with these stingless bees before, so uh, this will be an adventure. <laughs> Okay, well, that's what it looks like on the inside. So and they're all up in my business now. <laughs> that's okay, because I'm all up in their business. <laughs> so the important thing here is to get some of the brood and some of these honey pots into uh, both sides. And uh, looks like we have them pretty well that way. Rupert, come to come to mummy now. Rupert, come. Rupert, come. Come here. Rupert, the bees are getting you. Rupert, come. Come now. Not sure what this part's for. They're not stinging or biting, but they sure are just all up in my face. Interesting kind of sour honey. Now, it's a bit silly looking because these two beehives were made by different people, so as you can see, they aren't the same.
underneath it. And... Yeah, see, it looks like it's some way to. Uh... And you, t I don't know, you used to put it round the um, the other, that thing on the ground that you sit it on top of it. Oh, all right. The star pick it with. But maybe if we just taped it. And we could yeah, I'm just going to use the tip because it looks Rupert, simpler. If you look, listen, Rupert, come away from the bees. Don't like you. All right, so uh, that's that. Uh, one of these is going to have to be moved at least 500 meters away, or else all the bees would return to the original hive. And I think since we're not going to do that right now, we might close up the, uh, the entrance on the second one here, so they don't all return before we have a chance to move them. Which one looks like the, um, the one that's the sturdiest for going away somewhere to another um, place? Is that that white one on the top there? Is it? I'm just here. It's got a fair gap at the front of it. Oh, I'm does it? Just wondering if that's the oh, yeah, right here. Yeah. Yeah. Let me keep that up. In time, they'll uh, they'll propolis it up. They'll close it up. But for now, we can help them out. Rupert. But yeah, these bees, uh, they don't bite or sting, but they just kind of try to go in your ear and things. <laughs> Where was I? Oh, yeah. I think that's, uh, you know, we'll put this one back where we uh, got it from over here. I think that's a uh, done job. <laughs> confused bees over here wondering where their home went. Mm-hmm. <laughs>